My mate Ryan brought me a Volca sample which I fixed but that wasn't all that was in the bag. Here we also have a Scarlet Clarion audio interface. These are pretty high-end things. Focus like Claret, not Clarion. Octo Pre. So these are pretty expensive things and he says it's not working, it's not turning on or at least it's not staying on. So the first thing we're going to do is verify it on my own power so that I know what the fault is. So let's give it a shot, shall we? Let's have a look. See if we can power this bad boy up. Nothing at all. Hmm. Not even a flicky flicky. Okay, let's have a look what we're getting down that pipe. Should be getting in the region of 240 volts. Uh, but don't touch the prongs. Right, let's get it apart. It's giving it a sniff test. It does smell. Something might have gone. So here's the power board. There's the socket going in. I had it at the top right earlier. So it's around 180 degrees. It looks like this has been recapped. So someone's been in here before. Often when people recap something, they do mark them, as has been done in that case. Uh, I've got to be careful sticking my hands around here because this could well be, be live. But um, I'd like to know if there's any volts left on that board. Can you see that light flickering? It's like it's constantly resetting. It doesn't seem to be a fuse. Um, I'm getting about 30 volts at the voltage regulator. I'm getting no power light at all. Yeah, not got much to work on so far, but that is making a noise as well. Okay, let's check the fuse anyway. Um, I've got this case open, but... Yeah, we've got continuity across the fuse. I can't see any real faults here. This voltage regulator is getting a little bit hot, but not massively. Check this diode. Where is that? Check the voltage drop on it. 552 millivolts. Nothing. That diode looks good. So that one. Interesting. I don't, I'm not seeing any real problems with this so far. I am a bit scared with my probes in a power supply, even though it's unplugged. Oh, is that just straight through? Is that not a? It's not a diode, is it? Maybe that is duff. Don't know. Hmm. Don't really know enough about this to be honest. Where did that come from? Right, we're going to have a a pull of this power switch. I'll tell you for why. Because, oh, can I even get that out? Does that come out? <clears throat> I want to pull the power switch because I want to know if it's working, basically. There you go. This is one of the stupidest things I've ever done, isn't it? 240 volts, and if I turn off the power, not 240 volts, but not no volts. If I pull it, 
and then no volts. So it's getting a bit of smoothing there. So those caps are draining now. All right. It's not the switch. Okay, so here's the faults that I can see. 3.3 volt rail hasn't got the right voltage at all. 5 volt rail hasn't got the vol right voltage at all. And looks really unsteady. Um, these don't seem to do anything. This is the best rail, but it's not giving as much power as it should. Um, <clears throat> we know that the switch is good. We know that the power coming in is good. So recapping this board might work. This diode doesn't seem, it just seems to um, pass voltage. It doesn't, I don't know if it's supposed to stop anything or if it's just acting as a fuse, I don't know. 